page 23 of the staff emergency handbook. Again, the school is on lockdown until further notice. Adam, put it out. How long do we have to stay here? I don't know. Put it out. This is bullcrap. What's your language? Sorry. We're going to die anyway. That's not funny. Shh. No, I'm being totally serious. We're done. Barnett, that's enough. What? It's true. There's like terrorists in the hall or something. It's just a drill. They don't do drills for stuff like this, idiots. Hey, what did I just say? Be quiet. Why do we have to be so quiet? It's just the procedure we have to follow. To keep us all safe. From what? From terrorists. Tyler, once more, and you get detention. Oh, detention! <laughs> hey, just shut up. Why don't you shut up? Tyler, enough. Mark. Shh. Your attention, please. The school is still on lockdown. Teachers are instructed to follow the procedures on page 23 of the staff emergency handbook. Again, the school is on lockdown until further notice. There. You heard it. Heard what? That thing's so busted you could hardly ever hear it. Shh. Miss Gorsh, where are you going? It's okay, Sarah. I just need to get something from my desk. Sorry. Don't be sorry. Everybody's scared. <laughs> Miss Karsh, where are you going? <laughs> Hurry back, miss. I need you to hold me. <laughs> shut up, Arnett. You're such a jerk. You shut up, queer. What? Did you just call me? Oh, I believe it was queer. Queer. Why don't you come here and say it to my face, then? Come on. Sit down. Don't you guys know what's going on here? Well, let's see. I was sitting in Karsha's writing class, and all of a sudden she drags some kid from the hall and makes us all sit in the corner. In the dark? It's a lockdown. I know what it is. It's serious. It means there's a guy out in the hall with a gun or something. Or terrorists. Terrorists. It could be. Oh, I yeah, sure. It could, it could be. be. It really could be. Terrorists in Dearborn? It's just a drill. Mr. Harding told me that the teachers have to practice this. Harding said that. Yeah, like a fire drill. Harding has his head so far up. He's stoned half the time. They wouldn't have a drill for something like this. Well, no, it's gotta be. It's gotta be a drill. What if it isn't? What if there's some guy out there with a gun? <laughs> oh, who farted? Oh, my, you're such a pig. God. Hey, quiet. Okay, everyone listen. I thought we were supposed to be quiet. Adam, come on, help me out here. These are the rules for a lockdown. Listen up. You're to stay on the floor, out of sight. Students are not to talk or make noise. We're not supposed to turn on the lights or leave the room until we get an all clear call from the office. Well, how long do you think that's gonna be? I don't know, Mark. We just have to wait. Wait for what? <laughs> for dead! <laughs> you know what? You're so I'm what? Dead? I'm so dead? Just shut no, up! Stop it! Hey, don't! Why don't you look after your girlfriend over there? She's just about crapping her pants. <laughs> Guys, please, Mark. Well, I'm sorry. It's just that she ticks me off so much. Just ignore her. Well, what am I supposed to do, Sarah? Walk away? school board, right? Yeah. Well, that's how you know that this is just the drill, right? She said the teachers had to practice it last PD day. Just the teachers? They had to practice it. How do you know that this is a drill? What about today? Well, it was only a month ago. It would be kind of a coincidence if this one were real. 
Did she say it was a drill? It is. Did she say it? No. Your attention, please. The school is still on lockdown. Teachers are instructed to follow the procedures on page 23 of the staff emergency handbook. Again, the school is on lockdown until further notice. Liz, put away the phone. I'll have to take it. I just want to call my dad. I told you before, we can't make calls. Why not? If people start showing up, they'll get in the way of the police. Liz, she just wants to call her dad. I just want to tell him that I'm okay. I'm not going to ask you again. It won't be much longer. Everybody just sit tight. Sit tight? What was that? Never mind, just sit tight. I'm tight. <laughs> yeah. Unlike Liz, I hear. <laughs> right, Liz? Douchebag. <laughs> hey, who's that? Some grade nine. She was in the hall. That's the one Karsh dragged in. Hey, what's your name? Hey. Hello? Guys, we've got to get out of here. We can't. Well, why not? It's not like anybody's going to save us. We've got to save ourselves now. We have to stay here. But why? It's the procedure. Procedure. It's designed to keep us safe. Oh, the procedure. That doesn't keep you safe. You know why they even have a procedure? It's just a cover. So remember last year some guy got shot at Pickridge High School? My boyfriend is a guy who saw it. Says this older guy comes in looking for somebody. Then, when he sees him, pulls out this block and shoots him once in the head and once in the stomach. One minute it's normal lunchtime, and then the next, there's a dead guy in the front hall, right in front of the office. <laughs> pulls this clock. <laughs> what? I wasn't even talking to you. Just shut up. Or what? You'll pull out your clock? <laughs> Well, did they get the guy? He didn't even run. He just put away his gun and walked out the door. Come on. That's never going to happen. Somebody would have stopped him. Who? You? Yeah, I would. <laughs> no, no, seriously. <laughs> what makes you think I wouldn't? Do you even have to ask that question? You don't even know what I'd do. If some guy came in here with a gun, I'd stand up and take his butt. <laughs> <laughs> touch each other. <laughs> That's it. Come over here. I thought we were supposed to stay down. You know, in case somebody blows anthrax under the door or something. Come here. <laughs> what? You have to ask me that? You know, I have put up with your crap. My crap? All year, but you just don't get it. This is an emergency, and yet you continue to make filthy jokes and be a jerk. Oh, I'm a jerk. Yes, you are. 
That kid is scared to death. We are all scared. Now I need you to sit down and shut up. Can you do that, Tyler? Gee, I'm not sure. God, you don't get it, do you? No, I guess I just don't. Why don't you grow up? Sit down. Now. What'd she say? Nothing. <laughs> I hope this lasts for another hour. What? Why? So, uh, we got a math test and uh, didn't study it for you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I didn't either. For attention, please. This is Mr. Morris. The school remains on lockdown. All teachers are to. What? Hey, what's up? We should call the police. said that we'd be okay. The police are outside and we need to wait. Just wait. Adam, put 
put that out. Nobody can see it from the window. I said put it out. Shut up. Who died and made you boss? I can't believe this thing. What to do in case of a gas leak? Intruder in the school? Hey, wanna hear the code they use for a bomb threat? What? What is that? The South Emergency Handbook. <laughs> Listen to this. In the event of a lockdown, students are not to answer the doors and they are not to respond to the fire alarm because... What? Because the intruder may wish to lure students into the hallways that way. Who would do that? Who could think like that? Hey, come here, help me. Tyler, Tyler, go. Take them. You can take this one. Him. 
It's when people say, you should fear God. I mean, if God is love, then why should you fear him? Oh, <laughs> well, well, that's talking about respect. It's an old way of saying it, like suffer. Jesus says, suffer the little children to come unto me. When I was little, I asked my dad, why does Jesus want children to suffer? Well, why doesn't he? Toss it over here. Sinead, it's me. Where are you? Are you okay? Well, do you know what's going on? Our teacher booked it. Gosh. There he is. Yeah, we are. I just feel like I'm gonna throw up. Who's your teacher? Put her on. Miss Heller, do you know what's going on? Our teacher ran off. She ran after a girl and didn't come back. Well, do you know if she got out? Everyone's okay, but is there somebody in the hall? No, I know. We will. Nobody knew that was anything. <laughs> All the other kids with the pumped up kicks better run, better run, outrun my gun. All the other kids. Man, don't you ever shut up? Jeez, Dad! What's your problem? God! Answering machine. Why would God care about an answering machine? Why would he care about anything? Easy. He doesn't, because there isn't a God. Yes, there is. You know who's God? Whoever's out in that hall, that's God. Dad, it's, it's me again. We're all still at the school. Dad, are you there? I really need you to come to the school to pick me up. Please. Please come pick me up, Daddy. Where is I? You know what I heard? If you feed a bird rice, he'll explode. What? No way! No way! Get out! just laying all over the ground. So basically, if, if what you're saying is true, then there should be about 600 explosions every single lunch hour. Well, maybe she doesn't mean explode in the traditional sense of boom. <laughs> <laughs> like a pigeon, actually. What if it just explodes in their stomach and damages them internally? <laughs> Man, you take all the fun out of exploding pigeons, you know that? Life is so random. I know it. Here we are. Here. Now. Talking about exploding birds. You want to talk about something else? Something less random? Something like... Where is Karsh? <laughs> hey, you guys ever see that movie where that bird is just flying by and then it just gets smoked by that baseball? <laughs> 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 and then it's just flying by and all of a sudden it just explodes out of nowhere. <laughs> Did I ask for your opinion? What's your problem? You are. Guys, if you can't buy it at a mall, you don't care about it. It's like you do, you're on big world issues. Save the birds. At least I care about stuff like that. Oh yeah, you care. You know what? Screw you, I'm so sick of you. Little pretty princess. You just- Why don't you just leave? 
Nobody would care. Better you than us. Really? Hey, so let's just go sit down, okay? Hey. You know, at least I don't need to run to my daddy, all scared. Daddy, daddy, please help me. But your dad isn't answering, is he? How about you just go call your mom? Sarah. Oh, I forgot. That dumb slut left you, didn't she? Yeah? You didn't you say that! You you say that. that. Stay down. It's the police. We don't know that. Open the door. Wait. We don't know who it is. I think he's gone. What if the lockdown is over? What if we can go? They need to tell us. Yeah. It's all right. 